friends. Hey hems, how are we all diddly doing? So recently Vixella done a build challenge where she had to build a house but each room had to be a different pack and I decided to do this challenge and let's just say challenge is, is very much that is the correct word to use in this situation. Yes, it was a big fat challenge and I was also quite strict with myself so in the same breath as the solid colour build challenge where if you don't have something that, that's that colour you just can't put it well that's that's the route I decided to go down with this challenge so it's 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 a lot I hope you enjoy it yeah I'm gonna switch now okay have fun love yous do you like Eliza or Bob Mar? neither they're both doing me head in we are building on the pancake lot today funnily enough even though I hate Bob and Eliza but we do be building on the house today so this is the shell that I've made and I don't know how well it's actually gonna go because there's a oh sugar there's a lot of interest and roof sections over here. It's not going well, is it? <laughs> if I just plop roofs on and just don't say out about it, we can get away with it. We can't get away with it. Awful. Trust the process. We'll trust the process of the roof. I hate this with every single bone in my body. And then we could do something like that. But then, no, because I've just added to what I've just took off there. What we could do is have this bit as like a porch area. That could work as well. The roof's an arsehole. We're not talking to it. <laughs> you know, the roof shouldn't be like the, the main part of this video. Do you know what I mean? But I think it's, it's, it do be getting to that point. The roof do be looking a bit thick. Thicker than a bowl of oatmeal, that roof. <laughs> It's all right. It's fine. We're coping. We're thriving. We could just have like a big fuck off one. No. Why am I out here acting like I've never played The Sims before? Like, why am I struggling this much? That's gonna have to be it. I don't think I've met anyone who I hate as much as this roof, honestly. When I made this shell before the stream, I thought, easy, jobs are good and there'll be no wrong with it. It won't be hard. Oh, honey, I had a big storm coming, Jesus. It doesn't have to be the best house in the world, right? I think I'm getting a bit pedantic. I'm fucking game da. Right. One. Generate. Realm of magic for the outside. We can do this. Oh, we've got bricks. I don't want to be boring about it. A blue could be cool. I've never really done a blue build before. I might move the actual lot to the actual realm of magic. Actual. We're not thriving in Willow Creek. It's not the place for us. Bye bye, Eliza Pancakes, you big bitch. Maybe I'm lying to myself, but I do think already that it's looking better. I still don't know how I'm feeling about the blue though. I think the blue might look better if it was like a two-story house, but because it's not, it's not thriving, loves. I hate it here. I hate it here. <laughs> and we can go for a base game roof because I, I, I'm, I'm being nice to myself, self care and all that. No, I fucking hate it. I fucking hate roofs. I fucking hate playing games. It's shit. It might look better if we put it on a little, I say a little and I drag it up like fuck, a little foundation. Oh, thank God we've got columns. I would have wrote a personal letter to EA if we didn't. Oh, do we go proper fancy with them? Or are we just being extra? But I'm all right with being extra. I mean, it's a bit in your face, but like with what we've got, it's it's not doing too bad right now. It's allowed to be in your face because wizards. <laughs> Windows, we might actually be in luckier. I forgot they don't really have any beige stuff. It's fine, I'm gonna carry on. I might need to change the columns just to match with the actual fucking windows now. The outside is supposed to be Realm of Magic, but the thing is with Realm of Magic is none of the swatches match. I mean, that kind of does. So we might just have to go with that and just cope with it. <laughs> it's killing me that it's not matching. But I'm not gonna, like, I've got to be honest with you. I'm gonna call it Twitch because the stress of this is honestly giving me a fucking Twitch. Nothing matches in The Sims 4. That is very much adequate. I think the columns might look better as the white. That kind of pulls the, the winder in. The Sims 4 basically is out here saying, To see you suffer would be lovely, darling. Do we have planner boxes with Realm? Oh no, we've only got that. And I think that's gonna kill me. Not to take the Lord's name in vain, but like still, no, Jesus Christ. <laughs> we've got to have, just have base game stairs. I'm not struggling to that extent. That flooring is the only flooring that we can have on the outside. So there we go. I just want something to make it look nice. You know, oh, we've got this. I mean, that's something. We don't have any plants or out like that. I'm going to have to put some kind of tree. All right, we'll put that tree there. But I'm not going overboard with like base game stuff. I want to suffer with this challenge. So I'm only allowing some base game stuff if it's like strictly necessary. And apparently putting some rocks around a tree outside of a house is 100% necessary for me. We've got this bench. There we go. And we can have like lawn on. She's screwing me. I can feel it. I take it back. There is absolutely none. Is there anything? There is a fountain, but like it just looks a bit odd there. Do you know what I mean? We could put it in the back, but it still looks a bit odd. It looks like we've got a shrine or something. I'm not happy with it. <laughs> Let me just mother lord, because I'm not being poor in this game. Not today, hen, not today. All right, I am going to be sneaky and just put some out the front, because I'm not having a bare house, because I'll be embarrassed in Glimmerbrook if everybody else has got, like, the extra ugly-looking houses wherever they are. Like, look at them. They've got three floors. I can't be out here with no shrubbery on my front. So I am cheating a little bit, but it's right. If we all turn a blind eye, I pretend I do not see it. <laughs> I feel like we should keep the fountain just for the crack. Like, half of this is, is just for the crack. Right there, there is our fountain shrine. Are oh, you joking me? Are they only available on. Not to be dramatic. I f 
fucking hate my life. The doors are only available on the second highest height. So I am going to cheat just once more and I'm going to get the window box things out. The flowers. Just to hide it because I'm not... No. <laughs> I've had enough of playing games. I'm fucking game dad. It doesn't look great by any stretch of the imagination. But it looks more natural. It's also a proper weird layout. Like I'm looking around it now and I'm like, nah, it, it very weird. It's very weird. Right, we're going to be doing the living room. Strangerville. How? Oh, we've also got no windows. I guess the windows have got to be Strangerville as well. That's fine though, because Strangerville do actually be having windows. If we don't have it, I just can't put it. I'm not one for cheating. So, so I am cheating a little bit, but it's right. If we all turn a blind eye, are you f***ing joking me? Well, I might try and make this into like a modern thing. I've woke up feeling positive and I'm going to try and make this nice modern city. I'm going to big fat cheat with this. Give me a second. There's our brand new state of the art modern city. <laughs> it's innovative. Looks like a centipede. It does. <laughs> Maybe we can like just make it into a bunker. I don't know. We've got to utilize, overcome, advance. We do have a desk. We can kind of go with how crackheaded it is. Look, the story of the person who lives here is that they're a super spy from the 90s or summer and they've got to keep on top of everything, but they're kind of losing the plot. And that is as far as I'm going with that plot because I can't think anything else. <laughs> oh, and they run test subjects on the side. You know what? It do be kind of slapping though. It's either that tile or that. Please say we have, oh, we do have wallpaper, but it's that or it's that. I always say, I love Strangerville as a pack. I think that's because I like the doors and windows. But now I'm presented with like the reality of the pack. I'm out here questioning everything. Does Strangerville deserve to be defended? Or am I just going out on a limb for absolutely fucking nothing? Go hard or go home. So we're making it into the absolute. Not fit for a health and safety inspection place that it is. I don't know the relevance of this Excalibur looking thing. Me and this house, we do be vibing. I don't know what that is. It's hand sanitizer. Sanitizer. We're living in trying times. The outside was all right. We were doing well with the outside. Imagine that fountain at that point being the worst of our worries. And now it's like, four. get that fire exit dorm off. <laughs> I'm not going to say which bedroom we're going to do, whether it's going to be the kids or adults, till we see what we get. Toddler stuff. Got to be the kids' bedroom, hasn't it? <laughs> Did we get a bed with toddler stuff? I'm fucking hoping so, you know. <laughs> It's a fucking piss take. You're all taking the piss out of me. The toddler is going to have to sleep on some pillows. Nobody call the RSPCA. We could make this into a bed. I'm getting creative today, lads. I swear to you. My creativity knows no bounds. I can't be stopped. I can't be tamed. I am as I am. And I'm thriving in this challenge, you know. That's kind of cute. The ball pit should be the bed. Oh my God, it could be like the base of the bed. Now that would be absolutely class. Can you imagine having a ball pool bed as a kid? Is it usable? No. But that's not what we're trying to achieve with this one. <laughs> Oh yeah, have that. This could even be the... No, I'm going too far now. I need to just rein it in. It's just a cursed room. The room is fully cursed. We could have a bench. You know what? Sizing it down, it could be like a little mini toddler bench. That's kind of cute. Do you know what? The kiosk, it always works itself out in the end. I would ring the social worker myself if I had to walk through this living room to get to the toddler's bedroom. But turn in a blind eye. The toddler's bedroom, like on honestly, one would class themselves as lucky if they had this kind of room as a kid. It's not necessarily where dreams are made of. It's more where dreams go to die but still we don't have any wallpaper what we don't have in wallpaper we could make up for in balloons it is a fun room do you know what considering that it's only toddler stuff you'd never know you know if you squint your right eye and then squint your left eye and then squint them more until you don't see anything this build is quite good i think we should do the bathroom next because i hate bathrooms tiny living stuff we've got no floor no wallpaper but we've got a murphy bed so we're sorted lads we do have a toilet though and a sink and i'm pretty sure yep yeah, we've got a mirror no shower oh we can pretend that we've got a carpet with that this could be a nice chilled area we could have a nice seat there that bathroom's beautiful <laughs> Put the TV in. Oh my god, that's a class idea. You should have the TV visible from the toilet. There we go. Apart from the fact there's no wallpaper, like it's a pretty good bathroom, to be honest. This is the best bathroom I've ever done. And that sounds like I'm being sarcastic with you, but I'm really genuinely not. <laughs> this is the most effort I've ever put into a bathroom. <laughs> and it's got no wallpaper, right? But you know, it's a they've just moved in. Will you cut them some slack? <laughs> the thing is, they can't use the living room because the living room stuck up with all the spy stuff. So they've got to have the bathroom doubling as a living room we'll do the kitchen and then we'll do the the master bedroom the kitchen is cool kitchen stuff oh how the turntables eh please for the love of god have some wallpaper 
I think the kitchen might be the easiest room of all. Like, this is very straightforward. It's just a kitchen, in it? I tell the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help me God. You know what? I might even, I'm feeling generous. I'm going to give him a double oven. Because I'm just that way inclined. I'm just a nice person. Do you know what I mean? There you go, hens. Cook it up. Cook it up. And we also have room for dining table. We can have some books there. I get educated loves. We've used every single thing in the pack. We could make them mahoosive, right? And have them drop down. And then it's like a, oh, looks like hemorrhoids. I don't know if I like that. I don't know how I feel about it. It does look like piles. I'm going to size them down. <laughs> I'd love to be a fly on the wall when my neighbours talk about what they think I do for a living, honestly. Because I'm just sat here at 26 minutes past seven on a Tuesday afternoon going, looks like hemorrhoids. <laughs> right, the last pack that we've got to do, lads. F*** off. I'm not doing it. Oh, it's a piss take. They're all taking the fucking piss. I've had enough of playing games. I'm fucking game down. Fuck my life. Fuck my life. Fuck my life. And fuck them hemorrhoid looking fuckers on the ceiling. No, fuck it. I'm not. There's no floors. No walls. Oh, don't worry though, because we've got that. Well, I'm sorry, like you know, lads, but apparently the only person who lives here is a fucking toddler who's also a secret spy. Very good in the kitchen and likes a decorated bathroom because there's no possible way we can put another bed in here the only way that i can see us doing is it is if we make this like a vampire's bed oh actually that could work you know i mean looking at the stuff that goes on in here they're probably not a good sleeper so we could make this this is a vampire bed sorry there's our vampire bed i'm not one to judge everybody's got their thing there could just be a collector of statues there's a window with that pack screw them windows get out of here hen thanking you we could just have these windows all the way around there we go plumbella making useless packs worth it for two hours straight i do be trying and at least now we've got some some kind of wallpaper. If I could get it on the bastard wall. I'm still in a fucking state of shock that it's actually went well. I say well. Uh, I use that term loosely. Wallpaper, don't need her. This went well. <laughs> I mean, I'm not being funny, but if you don't sleep in a bed of rock, you're a fucking freak. Dem's the rules, sorry. You would not believe your eyes. The song can just stop there, to be honest. You would not believe your eyes. You would not believe your eyes. Thank you all very, very much for watching this video. This was all streamed on Twitch as well. I just cut it down in highlights. So if you want to watch the full one, you can go over there. I do stream a lot on Twitch now lately as well. I do be turning into a daily streamer, believe it or not. Oh, 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 I never would have thought that this would have been me, but I love on there. I also love YouTube too. So don't fucking, I'm not forgetting about you. Don't you worry, hens. I hope you enjoyed this challenge. You definitely try it yourself as well. I used James Turner's random generator pack, which helped a lot because I didn't have to like close my eyes and click a button. But yes, please subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. B -b 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 Bye, guys. Honey, you've got a big storm coming. Get a video, love me and my son. Get one photo of me and my old fella. Okay. Right. Get a video. I'm gonna write fucking stuff. Give us a smile. Get in the video. No, I'm taking a photograph. What's the matter with you? Get in the photo, are you? What is the matter yeah. with you? Take the video. Yeah. Take the video of me in a fucking window. You said it's a pub. It is a pub. Have I been inside the pub? No! It's a fucking window then.